This Road Dirt presentation is brought to you by Law Tigers, motorcycle lawyers. Find them at lawtigers.com. Hey, this is Rob with Road Dirt, and we are with our friend Kevin Baxter of Pro Twin Performance and Baxter's Garage, and it is a very special day yes, at is. the shop today. Tell us what's going on, man. Well, today we are actually very proud to announce that uh, with the help of several different people, of course, uh, Brian and Vanessa Clock and, and Gene and, and the whole crew at Clockworks combined with our YouTube channel members, our YouTube viewers. We've got Law Tigers that help sponsor this event. And what this whole thing is about is the All Kids Bike Program. And if you're not familiar with All Kids Bike, the whole idea, it's a big national initiative to get more kids on two wheels, get them yeah. physically fit. And the idea, if we get them on two wheels when they're young, hopefully they'll be on these two wheels That's true. when they get older. So yeah. what we've got are 25 bikes over there, thanks to everyone who donated, who bought our t-shirts and everything else to make this possible. And uh, we're basically taking these bikes, there's an entire curriculum with this. Oh wow. Uh, the, the PE teacher has to go through a, 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 a six week course and everything else. And it, it's actually an entire physical fitness curriculum that is put into the school. And so this, for all you guys that donated, this isn't just a few kids getting bicycles. Right, right. There will be thousands of kids over the next many, many years learning all over the United how States. to ride bicycles at a local school. So it's a pretty incredible program. So these bikes are all going to go in a, a local elementary school. You guys actually have one you're, you've selected that you're partnering with. And this is like, a, like you said, it's an initiative that's taking place all over the United States. And this is, I think you told me yours is the first one in the state of Georgia. We are the first one in the state of Georgia. And, and where, where I first learned about this program was a couple of years ago at the uh, Hamster's Dinner up in Sturgis. Okay. And, uh, you know, physical fitness is a big thing. Right. You know, you got to get kids fit. And if anyone's been to a, you know, a, a big box retail store, you know, years ago there were aisles full of bicycles. Oh yeah, yeah. <laughs> you go now and there may be one aisle full of bicycles, you know? And and we, we watch the motorcycle industry, we love it. And, and we can remember when we were kids putting cards in the spokes yep. and, it, yeah. and hearing the tick, 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 <laughs> oh, tick, yeah. you know? Yeah. So we want to get more kids physically fit. We want to yeah. get them outside, we want to get them active. And hopefully as they get older, we can get them on motorcycles. Absolutely. That's, that's the whole idea. So, um, and, and how we selected the school was, was uh, actually pretty simple. Uh, this area that, that I live in is a bit of an impoverished area. Mm -hmm. And of course, with poverty comes obesity, right? It's, that's true. it's unfortunate, you know? But, you know, people do what they need to do to survive. You know, it, it's, uh, you can get a Happy Meal McDonald's for two or three bucks, right? So, um, in, in working with the school and seeing all of these things, most of the kids at the school with me, are on the free lunch program, which means that you know parents can't afford to buy them a bicycle of their own, so they can go to school and be part of this whole program and learn how to ride bikes. Learn to ride and learn balance and learn uh, how to- Learn to, to ride life, man. How to ride, li <laughs> ride life. Right. Life. Learn how to ride life, that's yeah. exactly right. This is gonna be a great day. We're gonna hang around and get some photos, some footage, and talk to some folks. and. I just think what you guys are doing is fantastic. I think that we're glad to be here to cover it. So thanks. Good let's to see get, you, Robert. Let's get thanks started. Good to see you, right my on. friend. Yes, sir. Thanks, bud. All right. We're with Holly Whalen of uh, Law Tigers of Georgia. Hi, Hi. Holly. Good, good to see you guys out here. Good. Yeah, it's going to be a great day. Um, tell me a little bit about what is um, Law Tigers' involvement with this whole um, Striders for Kids in School. Oh, we're so happy to sponsor this. As you know, we are motorcycle attorneys, but however, we're involved in the motorcycle community before anything happens. So this is going to help foster the next generation of motorcycle riders. So we're excited to be here building bikes for kids and to partner with somebody like Kevin Baxter. Yeah, we do too. We're glad you guys are here. Yes, absolutely. Tell us a little bit about the bikes here. What's your name? My name is Jennifer Poole, and I'm the Jennifer. PE coach at Statham Elementary. Oh, cool. So you guys are getting the bikes. We are getting the bikes, and we are very excited about it. Now, tell me um, about these striders. There's something unique about these as far as they're able to be converted and... Um you know, as kids, they actually can grow with them, from what I understand, right? Absolutely. So the bikes start out with no pedals and just the pegs for the, the kids to learn their balance and be able to keep their balance. And once they learn that, they can put their feet on the pegs and just ride and cruise around and cruise down the hills. 
Um, and then the next step would be to- Got a rear sprocket right there, yeah. And then and a whole kit that actually fits right on here. Absolutely. With the front sprocket and pedals and everything. That's cool. And the next step would be to put the pedals on it and um, let them start pedaling. And they can do all this without the training wheels. So they convert from this straight to the pedals without the training wheels. Man, that's fantastic. And we are going to start this with our kindergartners and um, hopefully get them on their way, like Kevin said, from going from these two wheels to those two wheels. <laughs> <laughs> there you go. Very cool. The All Kids Bike Program is an entire curriculum that goes into a school. The bikes that you're building today are going to be ridden by thousands of children over the next several years. This is a big deal. And this is the first program in Georgia. So clap. This is all. Now, I first learned of the All Kids Bike Program in Sturgis about two years ago. We all know riders, motorcycle riders, are declining. It's a generational gap thing. We also know if we go to big box retail stores, we don't see bicycles on the shelf like we used to 20 years ago. Right? We would go to a retailer and we would see four or five aisles completely full of bicycles, shelves full of helmets. We don't see that anymore. And it's unfortunate. Kids need to be outside in days like this, right? Riding. Um, this, this program is going to be such a huge thing at our school. Um, like Kevin said, there are a lot of kids who don't have bikes at home. And the physical activity that these kids do outside of the school is very minimal. I mean, they they don't have bikes or they don't have things to do or they don't have parents at home. Um, they just don't go outside anymore like we used to, you know. And I see it all the way from kindergarten all the way to fifth grade. You know, when I have these kids who can't run half a lap around the gym without giving out a breath, it just, it breaks my heart because they're not, they're not physical anymore, you know. A lot of them are, are doing this with their video games or their phones and stuff. And I'm like, why don't you go outside, you know, go outside and play. So um, I am super grateful for this program. I'm hoping by starting them off on the right foot with these bikes, it's going to want to get them out more. And then it's going to get them, you know, being physical and, and take them in the right direction. Um, it's going to be in our kindergarten program. So this year, like Kevin said, it's an eight week program. So I'm going to have about 150 kids doing it. Um, I took a class, I got my certificate. So it's not just, you know, these bikes being donated to our school. It's, it's a process, it's a program. They're gonna start with the, the balancing and putting their feet on the pedals and, and then we're gonna to graduate to the, um, like I said, to the pedals and I cannot wait to see their faces when they see these bikes. I've got this whole little pep rally planned out in my head, me riding out on my bike and you know, the bike's behind a curtain and the teacher's dropping the curtain and they are gonna be ecstatic. I'm very honored that Kevin chose our school to be the first school in Georgia. Um, no pressure there, you know. So we've assembled all the bikes, gotten everything finished, even a teacher's bike. What a day it's been. So it's exciting to be a part of a program that um, is going to help the next generation get on motorcycles. And if nothing else, get fit, get healthy, get outside again. That's really, that's the most important part, I think, really. I want to thank Kevin Baxter and his crew for putting this together and inviting us to be here. Uh, Holly and Law Tigers and Clockworks for putting all this together and making it possible. And for Statham Elementary School that's going to get to receive these bikes and the program that they're going to get to do with them. Getting kids back on two wheels and back exercising and moving. And the All Kids Bike Program is taking place all over the United States. Hey, let's help the next generation get outside, get healthy, and get on bikes again. It's Rob with Road Dirt. Ride life.